Hey everyone, Merrick here. We're back in the wonderful world of Factorio, and my stream has put me to shame. Well, this is awesome and everything. Um, it's not very efficient, and as we learned, there are better ways to do these things in the ways that I am doing them. I know. Hold your shock. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do that. What are you... Why are you putting them there? Stop that. Okay. So you're, you're doing doing the research on the solar energy. Um, what I really should look at is switching to walls. And walls are had from... Um... Actually, I don't need walls because we're not as close to the baddies as we were. And I think I might already have walls. Um, okay, we'll just let it do what it's doing. And see what we can do about making the green from this horrible, inefficient system that I have set up here. Alright, so. Let's put you down and find out what we need for green green is tracks which we have and inserters um and an inserter well crap i should have picked that up um is circuits which we have and gears and iron plates which we also have okay so i can make green and red by the bucket load at this point and I do have some fairly efficient output of stuff. It's just down here is where all the inefficiencies are. So we're going to go ahead and turn all these guys off. And just pick these up. Thank you for the auto save at 2 minutes. I need to change that to like 10. Okay. Get that. Um, I also need to make another tool. We'll make a steel axe real quick. That ought to help. There we go. That's so much better. Alright. Um, so we have this going up here, which is fine. We do need to adjust our power. So... <clears throat> yeah. Time to make green. Alright, that's going to make inserters right because we've got belts we need inserters so you will make inserters and you will make inserters and then Let's have red and green output here. Um, yeah. Red and green can be output there. Uh, you need coal. I've got plenty for you. And then we can just go ahead and pick all the green up here, because we're going to need to take that with us. We need you. Yeah. This isn't going to be as efficient as it should be, but I think it will be okay. Um, so we're going to bring... We don't need two. So we're going to bring the supplies that we need past here. And then... Well, that's there. So really, these need to come down some. They need to come down to start here. Okay. That's no problem. We could do that. That's no That's no thing but a chicken wing. Okay. I'm really wanting to get research up and running as quickly as possible. Which is why I'm focusing on it so much right now. Alright, so you need to be able to pick up from there and put it in there. 
and then from here and put it in there. Sorry, right, like that. I need to make a long one, which we of course can because I have all the supplies I need. From there into there, from there into there. Yep, and there we go. And here we are. Why don't I have any more belts? I was gonna say, I know I have belts. I have buckets of belts. Okay, <clears throat> there we are for now. That's where we're at. So let's go ahead. Um, you're gonna output your bits to here. And we're going to have a filter inserter here to pick up all of those. Okay, that works. I want you to pick up um, circuits and I want you to pick up copper tubes. But don't work yet. Okay, then you're gonna do that. And you're gonna do this. You're going to get power. So you need steel and circuits. Um. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Don't. Don't pick up circuits. Leave circuits in there. Okay, just pick up any copper tubes. You can leave the circuits that you have, though. And then this will come down. Like so. <clears throat> and... How are we going to output them? Actually, let's do this. Because you can output off this line here. which will link up to here just fine. All right, there. And then you'll go from there to there, from there to there. And then we need um, two long ones to pull from there into there. Okay, yeah, that didn't work that needs to be there okay there's that and now you need gears shit I forgot this thing needs gears how are we gonna get it gears I know how we'll get it gears you guys are gonna hate this um <laughs> <coughs> No, I don't think we can run gears off of here. I think we need to run... I can't. I don't think we can run green here. I think we need to run the gears and belts up to here. And have these guys make inserters. Okay, and then have... Oh, shit. Stop it. All right. Let's pick these up. Come on. Okay. Then we can have circuits run over to here. We'll stop that for a second. Let's get power over to here. Okay, <clears throat> so then we can have circuits come through here. And apparently some crap that we don't really need. Um, and then we can have steel and... Um, gears and belts go on this track here. 
like that. Okay. And then um, steel can go here. That copper is going to be a problem. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, that, that didn't work at all. Um, let's have the steel come from the middle line here. Because that's all just steel. And that, that'll work. Hold on, let me pick all this up. There we go. Okay, and then... We can have... Um, an inserter here. And a chest. For gears. So, yeah. Okay, and then, um, how are we going to get our output? That's a good question. Okay. That's a really good question. Do I need to put a pole space between these or can I hit it from here? I cannot hit it from there. Stop it. Okay, so there a pole. Here a building. There a pole. There a building. We can do that for now. It's not the it's not ideal, let me put it that way. All right, so it's going to extend our line a little bit, but that's okay. So go from there to there. Go from there to there. Um, like so. Okay, he's going to pick all that up. All the leftovers. Um, but you actually need to move down a bit with your leftover picking up, so we'll move, we'll move that later. You're going to make inserters. Okay, you have everything you need but gears. We can get gears for you in a second. Um, what, do you, what is your deal? Why is there just a gear sitting there? Stop it. Alright. You're making inserters. Oh, I could just have the output come from behind it. Duh. Why am I an idiot? We'll just have an output here. Let's see. Inserter. And then we can have it come down here. It's not the most efficient, but it'll work. Eh. There we go. And then we can just have these go here. And then we can have output here, here, and here. All right, there we go. And these guys will come in and get on the outer line. And then we can have um, green being made at these two centers here. So I want in and in and out and out. And we'll have red um, made from somewhere else. We'll do an underground line and bring the steel across or something like that. I don't know. I, I honestly don't know yet. This is a really bad system that I've got set up already. So, you know, bear with me on that. <laughs> 
Eh, well. Hopefully you guys didn't expect better from me. I mean, let's be honest. But we should get a lot of green. <laughs> yeah, that worked. That's kind of cool. Okay, and then here. Right there. Take from there. We'll put it in here. And these are going to be gears. Okay. So any gears that make their way past here just get picked up and dumped off. And then there's some green. Alright, and red. What does red need? Red needs copper and gears. Oh, that's interesting. I can run a line of copper off of here and get a, a copper run right along here to make red. Huh. Okay. So I need to make some more gear factories right there. And this is going to pull from here and output there. Excuse me, I need more of those. Can you help me out? Thank you. So pull from here, output there, output there. Okay. Gears, gears. <clears throat> so I'm not being very specialized, but I'm okay with that. If I'm being honest. Ooh, here's a thought. And this is a this is a silly little thought. Um, red needs copper plates and gears, and I've got gears here. Just being all sorts of, of levels of weird. What if I did a filter inserter to um, an underground line? Okay, it's going to come in here, it's going to go out there, it's going to come in here, it's going to go out here. No, that's not going to work very well. Well, I don't know. Maybe this will work. Let's see. Let's pick you up. Let's put you here. Let's put you there. Now you're going to move copper plates. Can you reach them? You can. Okay. That's fantastic. Because that's what I need. Alright, we got copper plates there. Now I need facilities to make all the red. So let's make some red facilities here. Um, how are we going to do that? I could pull the copper down here and then do long inserters. to make red down here and then bring all the red up here and then do a double line of people not people but you know what I mean things so we don't want it to be down here we want it to be here and excuse me I'm gonna need like three of those so you're going to pull from there, insert to here, and then, okay, well, I'm making a bunch of those, apparently. Stop that. Okay. All right, let's grab these from storage. Don't need those. So then we'll pull 
excuse me, we'll pull um, copper from here and we'll output our product here and then we'll bring red around and this is this is just wildly inefficient and it's just gonna make everybody mad and I don't care all right there's the copper line boom copper incoming that's perfect okay and then here's the red line bringing us out <laughs> oh, this is stupid. Okay, um, you're gonna make red, and you're gonna make red. And you can't reach that line. So I need you to input. There we go. Which means you're not gonna be able to put it on the right track, are you? Uh-oh. I goofed. We'll see. Oh, it is. Oh, it is. I didn't goof at all. I, I did the opposite of a goof. Okay. So I got some more track here. Then we're going to bring it up like this. We're going to bring this down to here. Yeah. Right? No, because I don't have enough damn inserter room. Hold on. Okay, you need to go up, up. And we need to make more of those guys. I'll take two more of those. And then inserter from there to there, from there to there, from there to there, from there to there, from there. And let's say there to there. Thank you. Thank you. And then we can just run you. Eh. Nope. I got stuck. Like this. And then we can run you. Like this. And then. We now have better research. You know, once I get power up. Okay. Power shouldn't be a problem, though. Eh, get off it. There we go. Now our research should be better. Ish. We're not producing enough red. What are you waiting on? You're waiting on gears. But he's stealing all the gears. Okay, um, you now make gears. You now make um, tracks. There we go. Now these guys are fed, and this guy here is waiting on gears. Oh, he doesn't have an input. Let's give it another output and then rotate this guy to be input. There we go. Now red should be back in action. Okay. It's going way far to do its thing. And that's just a bit madness, but... I'm okay with that. And I want this to be like this. Well, not exactly like that. That's just silly. But like that. Just for aesthetic reasons. I, I like it like this. Actually, you know what? Let's give it... A one space. Like we have on the other one. 
And there we go. <laughs> oh, crap. This is just stupid. This method that I have made is just so many levels of dumb. But it works. And maybe that should be part of the problem. Maybe it shouldn't work. All right, let's start out putting more red here. Because why not? If we're being honest. Um, you should reach that. I need more of those. Then I need you. And you. We'll get some power for you. We'll get an inputter, another outputter, and actually, I think you need to go closer to the line. Don't you? Yeah. Oh, I broke it. Okay. And then we can do that little deal there. And you are now making red. And you are now making red. All right, let's see if, if those reach where they're supposed to. This gear backup is just ludicrous at this point. Okay. It's funny, but it's a bit ludicrous. Okay, they output. My power is just really, really suffering. I've got to go address that next. I mean, look at how slow everything's running. Ah, it worked. Fantastic. Okay, so we've got to fix our power problem. Um, you guys have been screaming at me to do that, and I really should. I think I just killed my entire network here. That's okay. We need to streamline all this power anyways. Like, I need more boilers, and I need all sorts of stuff. And I've got to clean all this up. These power lines are just god-awful. Okay, I'll clean that up. Clean that up. Bring these over to here. That's better. Look at how slow everything's moving. That's because my satisfaction is way low. Can't get none. So what I can do... So I can fix that. Okay. First, we're going to pull this. And then we're going to make more of these dudes. More boilers. Um. Oh. What do I need? I need steel and stone. Okay. So we need more boilers. Did that connect? There we go. I need an inserter. Go from there to there. I need um my steam engine back and a couple of them. Okay, there's that guy. There's that one. So the more steam engines I have the more power output I can get, which is ideal. So my satisfaction's a little bit better. Um, I do need more boilers, and I need more um, more uh, steam engines. So apparently they can only support 10, by the way. All right, you're now feeding coal to there pick you up and we're getting rid of you and we're gonna build one of those as soon as I can get some some iron excuse me need to borrow all that thank you thanks guys appreciate it okay um let's see here build a couple of you so there are better ways, obviously, to do this as well. We don't need a single output one. I um, guess the best place we could put that is there. That's fine. 
Um, as I learned in the last little ditty, we can make little loops in here that will vastly improve our output. Okay, I can yank that one off and we can get our double line being fed again, which is fine. This will feed our coal line, which is all the way down here. Look at that. Are you guys really just stealing all of his his food? That's not very nice. Well, here. You know what? Since they're picking on you, because I'm a bad designer, have some coal. There. So as we continue our thrust into understanding, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put more of these down like so, which are really going to just start pumping out the coal eventually. I mean, let's, let's keep in mind, I am, I am under powering everything right now because I need a shitload more boilers which I need stone for and I don't have a good resource for stone right now so that kind of sucks I've got to clean all that up too um yeah it's a start man it's not a very good start but it's certainly a start Look at all the red that we've got now. So our solar energy should be moving along pretty nicely. We should have a consistent research pace at this point because of our new setup. Yep. Well, I say that we're now eating all of the gears before they get down here to make that. So... Yep, he didn't get any gears. So I need to get tracks made somewhere else, basically. And I need some long inserters here to pull steel when I need it. So let's go ahead and make a bunch of those. Um, just to make sure that we get the steel we need when we need it. That'll vastly speed up our production because I mean they're waiting on steel to come from here when you know it's it's not necessarily going to because we've got all these splitters running so now I need to you know just juice my um, steel production by a lot so we'll get that guy burning again and don't need any of these tracks running. I mean, copper's doing fine. It's now steel that I need to go through and, and redo. Um, it does have a lot longer of a trip. And I need to just do like a massive grindy loop out of this. This has gone back to a more efficient mode. Which is good. Um, we can now do a double boiler set up as well so each line can hold 10 so if I come off here and split the pipes I can run two of these side by side but I still need just a ton of stuff for it so we're gonna have to work on that all right well uh, that is not really stone okay okay well you know what we've got to start um, it's not a great one, but it is a start. Our pollution should be fine. We haven't really done anything. I need to get to these yellow spots of stone and set up some sort of feed process for them. But there's so few stone spots that it's actually becoming a bit of a problem. I'll go through and I'll clean up all of these tracks as well, these extra ones that don't do anything. Just to, to clean things up a bit more. But I like it. I like our start. It's not terrible. Uh-oh. They're the aliens. 
Well, fortunately, they're really far away because I gave myself a shitload of cushion. This map does kind of suck for stone. Look how far stone was away stone is. Huh. That sucks. Okay, so we're going to have to figure that one out to make more boilers. Um, and we're going to have to figure out the whole metal situation. Coal is fine so far. Well, we know what we've got to do. Alright, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, leave a like, if you have any comments, suggestions, turn on the comment section below. And of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking that good old subscribe button. And YouTube will let you know when to get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time.